At Stars Mill High School, students can use the school district's network where homework assignments, review sheets, notes, and other resources can be accessed. The students read their assignments and do research in advance so they can use classroom time for discussion and getting questions answered. They can access the book online, and Bailey does have that access. He can also access any resource he needs through U.S. History, just doing his own individual research from it. And he's given a sheet, a review sheet, for what we're doing for that point in time on a Monday, and it works throughout the whole week. Bailey is pleased with the independence he gains from using the technology supports. I've been getting most of my projects done completely by myself this year, and the past couple years with the program. Ever since I got the laptop, it's been very, very easy and very little help from outside. All right, let's get to the Watergate break-in. Okay, uh, Bailey, what's unique about this Watergate break-in? What you know about it? Go ahead. Well, it had several levels. It was after pretty big, pretty big hotel. The things we do differently in class are really, for him, mainly to help behavior. So much of the printed material and the um, electronics that he does are at home and on his own. Bailey knows quite a lot about U.S. history. He has these uh, comments that he wants to make, so um, him blurting out and knowing when to contribute and how to contribute appropriately has been um, one of the things we've had to deal with in class. In the math class, the collaborative teachers utilize technology such as the interactive whiteboard system, which also supports Bailey's learning. We put the blank copies of any worksheets on the website. Vicki Morgan, who is the uh, regular ed teacher, has those up on our whiteboard or our screen, and we have the Mobi system, so she's able to write notes right on what the kids are seeing. Bailey doesn't have to write everything because a lot of stuff is already there, so he just has to put in important information that he feels is necessary. As the technology system supports Bailey's reading and written expression, he also receives support for behavioral issues. He participates in the Triad program, which is a special education program designed for students with autism. The Triad program is actually a program where we focus on communication skills, social skills, and emotional regulation. The focus of the program is to help the kids like Bailey be able to handle the stress and frustrations and everything that goes with being in high school so he can be a better learner. As the use of technology and accessible content has provided access to the curriculum, Bailey's behavioral issues have diminished and his relationships with peers have blossomed. All right, you got the first pick on your team for Jeffrey. Let's go. I pick Bailey. Bailey, you're up. Whenever we have games or anything like that, Bailey's the go-to guy to, to, to get on your team. He's been hand-picked most of the time. Hey, we want Bailey on our team. We want Bailey on our team because Bailey has done his research outside of class, and he's done the things he needed to do using the programs that were given. During the break-in, they somehow got back to security and stole information about the um, Democratic Party. He's so much more confident in his abilities now compared to what he was as a ninth grader. With the support of the technology and accessible materials, Bailey describes what has changed for him. Well, my grades been consistently higher. Stress load, I was, you know, almost having nervous breakdowns every time I heard the word project. So now I'm like, oh, I've got time. I thought the 1.5 was a z-score, so I went on the chart and find the, the um, probability for 1.5 and negative 1.5 and subtract those apart. Educators have high expectations that Bailey will go on to college. 90% uh, plus of Stars Mill graduates go on to post-secondary options, the college options for the most part. I see Bailey being part of that 90% and I know that he will do well. Well, what we've talked about recently, we had his yearly IEP meeting. So he has one more year in high school. And what we're talking about is a, a local, a community college. Billy's mother reflects on what she thinks his future will hold. It is all about his independence and it spurred his desire to do it more, which is what we want for Bailey. We want him to set goals for himself, to reach those, and to continue growing higher. Because this will be the technology that gets him through college. Because it doesn't look like his print disability is going to go away. It's, this is here to stay, but so is the technology. He will have that, and with that, he will be able to succeed. Bailey's academic success and engagement in learning can be attributed to several fundamental elements that work in concert with each other. 
access to core curricular materials through technology, and accessible instructional materials help him overcome his reading and writing disabilities. The Triad program assists him in developing social and self-regulating skills. Concerned and knowledgeable educators and supportive parents have contributed to making everything work in tandem so that Bailey could become the engaged and successful student that he is.